everybody so today I'm going to be showing you how to make ombre nails and the final nails just look like this and I was actually requested to do this video so I'm just going to go ahead and do it for you guys I hope you guys enjoy thank you guys for all your video suggestions lately I will be doing a summer series starting here in about a week or two and it's just going to include some makeup hair, clothes, um, just things like that. So go ahead and send me any suggestions that you guys have. So without further ado, here's the nail art tutorial. So here are the things that you will be needing. First off, you are going to need any top coat. This is from Beauty Secrets. And then you're going to need a white. This is from Broadway Nails, which you can get at Dollar General. This is also from Broadway Nails, and it is called candy apple or green apple can't remember and this one is from Avon and it is called electric and you're also going to need a makeup sponge or makeup applicator so you're just going to go ahead and take the white and start applying a coat of it onto your nails and you're probably going to end up having to do two coats of white but that's okay depending on how much you put on the first coat And you're going to want your nails to dry in between coats. So first off, you're going to start with a little makeup sponge. And the part where it's smaller, you want to lay that down. And you want to put the color that you want first in the ombre at the top right on it. And what I like to do is just make little lines. And then you want to put the second color right directly underneath it. And it's okay if they're touching. That will help with the ombre effect. And you just want to go ahead and pick it up and then put it directly onto the nail. And I know that's my middle finger, sorry, but we're just going to keep applying layers of it to your nails. And you can just build up the color as much as you want. There is no right or wrong. And yeah, so I'm just going to keep on applying coats. So you're just going to keep on putting the nail polish onto the sponge and then applying it to your nails. And it might take quite a few coats to build it up depending on the nail polishes that you own. But I will come back to you as soon as I have well, this. Halfway through the process, I actually switched purples because this one wasn't showing up as much as I wanted it to. So I went for a darker purple, still from Avon, but it's just a little different. And so I'm taking this top coat and just applying that right onto my nails. And it really helps with the ombre effect because it blends the two colors together. And then what you want to do is wait for that top coat to dry so that you can clean up around the outside of the nail. I'm just going to take some Q-tips and I'm using this non-acetone nail polish remover and I'm just going to dip some into the container and then just go on the outside of the nail and just really work on wiping that off. And if you can't get it completely off, it's totally okay. Just take a shower, honestly. Because that's like the easiest way to get the nail polish um, off your nails. But just make sure your nails are completely dry before you go get in the shower. Because you don't want your ombre nails to come off. So I'm just going to work on taking off this nail polish from the outside of my nails. And I will come back to you as soon as it's off with the final results. So these are my final nails and I will be inserting a picture right about here. So these are really nice and fun for the summertime. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye!